When we moved here, um, my husband was diagnosed with Alzheimer's. I was very fearful. I'm 81, and I was very fearful. How am I going to take care of this 200 and something pound man with this disease? And I had no experience with it. So I got depressed, and Chris saw it, and she arranged for me to have 12 meetings with a therapist from a, a group called Senior Reach. So Chris said, oh, we can get you help in anything. The biggest thing is we don't know, most of us, what's available. And you've got to have somebody like that to tell you. And so she arranged, and at this point now, I have a young man who comes in and helps him shower and shave and everything once a week. And boy, that's better than it was. <laughs> Don't complain. He likes them. It's fine. And while he's there, he cleans the bathroom. And that's wonderful. I feel like princess. <laughs> Call it a social club. I never want to make him feel, you know, put down anyway. He's a well educated, wonderful man. And he um, goes there and he likes it. He can't remember what he did, but he always says they're nice people. <laughs> Um, we had financial difficulties and she arranged for him to be on Medicaid and that is just, I can't tell you, um, we were really going down the tubes. She not only made the arrangements, she's also made, she finally took a long fight she said, but she's got a Medicaid person that comes once a month that she can talk to and you don't go over there and sit in lines and all that kind of stuff. So when I was going to see that lady, she was so kind she came up to me and said, oh I'll go with you and she did. You sort of feel like people know who you are and they want to help you. And as I say, the residents help each other immeasurably. They bring meals to each other. Um, of course, there's always the little stuff that goes on that makes it fun, you know? <laughs> but uh, it's nothing ever big and, and uh, people have changed other people's lives. I'm beginning to feel like the old pet. I'm beginning to feel like I've got some confidence and cheerfulness and hope. 